And I think they're going to be hoping to avoid a lot of ending, ending double plays. First pitch, and we are officially underway as Tanner Santos once again leaves it off for Babson, facing Luke Pfeiffer, who gets the start today on Saturday. Getting the call here. Swung on and grounded to Harris, out number one. Hitting second for Babson, the first baseman, Chris Basile. Swings through that one, strike three. Hitting third for Babson today, the center fielder, Luke Tanner. And there's ball four, he loses him. And the first base runner for the Babson Beavers of the day. And that'll bring up the dangerous third baseman, Brant Savage, went one for three in yesterday's game. Runner goes, throw in time. Out number three from the arm of Nicholas Lazera. And on the mound for the Babson Beavers, Greg Neeskins. Now Maddox McDonald leading off. Went one for three in yesterday's game. Got a single in the very first at bat of the day. And he takes strike one there. Because last time with Spalter, Tigers knocked him out very quick. Swings through it. And a base hit for Maddox McDonald. So once again, a leadoff knock for the right fielder, and the Tigers have their first man aboard. It'll bring up Ty Preston hitting second today. And ball four, it looks like they call, as Preston makes his way to first base. I'm wondering if it was ball four, if it was catcher's interference, because the ball did hit the bat. Yeah, that's what I was wondering, too. It looked like he fouled it off. Preston trots over to first, and I think you might be right about that. That's the only thing that makes sense. Either way, first and second, nobody out. Lazara squares up to bunt, gets this one down fair. Runners will advance, throw to first in time, and the sacrifice is complete. So the sacrifice bunt moves two runners in the scoring position for Cal Coney. Swings through that to center field. Catch made, we'll see if they tag. McDonald will, he comes home, and it's one nothing Trinity. And it brings up Brandon Nelson, who blew this game open yesterday. Hit in the air. And a great catch made and left by Sadowski to end the inning. Swung on to left field. Maddox under it. Runner tags, comes to home, and will score. Throw goes to third, but safe there as well. And the sacrifice complete, two down, and Babson ties the game. 2-2 two -two pitch. Outside, full count. Lazara throws as the runner goes. Now a throw home, play at the plate, in time! Ground ball, could be two. And it is. Four, six, three on the double play, and there's the first two outs of the inning. Three, two pitch from Pfeiffer. Played to right and gets down for a hit. So Basile aboard with the first hit of the day for the Beavers. A really good location for that pitch. Swing and a miss, strike three. And he gets McDonald for his first strikeout of the game. It's on him reaches even double digits in an, any given season. Strike three called. Neeskins finds the zone and back-to-back -back Ks for the Babson pitcher. Sacrifice bunt that advanced two runners on base. This time two outs, nobody on. Lazara lifts it to center. Back at the wall and it finds it. Lazera rounding second, and he'll stay there for a stand-up double with two down. Game got out of hand pretty quickly. Take strike three. Coney goes down looking, and Niskins gets three strikeouts. Swing and a miss, strike three. Second strikeout of the game for Luke Pfeiffer, and there's two down in the inning. Swing and a miss, strike three. And another strikeout for Greg Neeskins. 
That time he gets Nelson. Gives up some redemption there defensively. As Hasdovic up. Puts that one into right, going back at the wall. And it's a fair ball. Hasdovic parks it at second. And a one out double for Ryan Hasdovic. 3 1. Swung on. Hit to left field, back at the wall, it is gone. A home run for Jack Julian and the Beavers are on top for the first time in the series. From the new pitcher for Trinity, Michael Bokey. Swing and a miss, strike three. Bokey gets Santos on the full count pitch, two down in the inning. Ground ball to Harris and it gets through. So a two out knock for Chris Basile, his second single of the game and this inning will continue. Grounded. Baker with the throw, not in time and Basile reaches. 0-2 pitch for Bokey. Got him strike three. Inside edge looking and Savage does not agree. Talks to the umpire as he walks back to the dugout. Very fast from the mound. Peterson swings through it and it gets through for a base hit. Peterson rounds first, but will stay there content with a lead off single for Trinity. So one down after Tinker flies out. Top of the order, Maddox McDonald up. As they check on Peterson again, that one close. And they got him. Jack Peterson thrown out at first base and a huge play for the Babson Beavers. Strike three called. McDonald goes down looking and Neeskins gets out of the fifth with no damage done. Still 3-1 Beavers in San Antonio. And warming up for the Tigers, Shepard Tyler the first year. Grounded, could be two. Can't quite get the handle. We'll see if he's safe at second. And they do get the out. That's what I was thinking. That, that's exactly the word I was thinking. Grounded into play. A base hit for Hasdovic. The run comes across and Babson extends its lead to three. 3-2 three pitch to Santos. Grounded, fair ball. Into right field. The bobble from McDonald and runs are going to come in for the Beavers. The runner from first stays at third and another run put on the board by Babson. It's Luke McClintock throwing for Babson. Lifts it into center field and it's a base hit for Nick Lazera. Up the middle. Gets through for a base hit. Around comes Preston coming in to score. The throw not in time, and there's a run on the board for Trinity. Most important thing, just keep the inning going. Harris to right, catches made. Tagging is Lazera coming home and scores. A sacrifice fly for Colt Harris, and it's 5-3 as the Tigers work back. It's maybe fortunate for Babson because that could have been very dangerous as Peterson skies that. Julian back, can't make the catch. Runner goes home and he's safe. So an error by Jack Julian in the field and the run comes home to make it 5-4. Everyone, but that run coming in, I think they're saying they caught it on that drop. Gets down, and it's in left field. A run's gonna score for the Tigers, and this inning will continue. Hit in the air, deep left field, it's gone. Brant Savage hit 11 home runs last season. There's one on the year. Gives Babson the lead right back. And a new pitcher for the Tigers in a 6-5 game, it's Jack Breezy. Played into center and it gets down for a hit. Nowak stays at second and the Beavers have two aboard with one down.
with the losses of Jack Martinez and Harrison Durow. There's strike three. Gets him looking and there's two down in the seventh. Thinks he can hit anything. Hit in the air to right. Maddox McDonald back at the wall, not gonna have a play. Home run for Ryan Hazdovic, and he's blown it open for Babson. One two pitch. Line to center, and it's another base hit for Babson. Runner gets sent home, and he's in to score. 10 5 Beavers off a base hit from Chris Basile. Tie the game in the sixth inning. Babson puts up five of their own. Put into right, and it's another hit for the Beavers. Another run will score. Another being waved around, and it's 12 5 Babson. A new pitcher for Trinity, it's Trajan Lee, the sophomore and transfer from Dayton. Hit in the air to deep left field, back at the warning track and it's gone. The third home run of the inning and Brent Savage's second. It's 14 to five Beavers. A new pitcher on the mound for the Beavers. It's Zach McGee, the graduate student. Strike three as Preston goes looking. McGee gets his first strikeout of the season. After year, it makes sense why no team has a really big advantage over the other. Strike three as Hastings goes looking. Back to back strikeouts for Zach McGee and it's two down in the bottom of the seventh. And the sacrifice fly RBI. Grounded to short and no play made. Remember for a while that the, uh, was the only way runners were even getting to base. Swing and a miss, strike three. Lee gets his first strikeout of the game as Hazdovic heads back to the dugout, one down in the inning. Really, a fly ball is the worst thing. Hit into left and it gets down for a knock. Another base hit for Babson as a two out single for Jack Julian. Did he go? Yes, and that ends the inning. Bottom of the eighth coming up, a 14 to five Beavers lead. Given a new pitcher for the Beavers, it's Matt Malone. And ball four as he loses Nelson, but it's funny to be around Pedroia for many years. Said nobody worked harder than him. As that's grounded into left field, a base hit for Colt Harris. First two runners reach for Trinity. Runners on first and second for the Tigers is Christian Holloway, another pinch hitter. Hitting for Jack Baker. It's Holloway deep to center field. It'll get down and one hops the wall. That scores a run and it's 14 to six. Now another pinch hitter is Pierce Matthews up. Really trying to make Babson nervous. Matthews to left field. Back at the wall, it's gone. The first at bat in the Trinity career of Pierce Matthews is a three run homer and it puts the Tigers within six. To Brett Jones, another pinch hitter for the Tigers. So far the man is still Matt Malone. Jones into left and another base hit for the Tigers. Still no outs for Babson as everybody's reached in this inning for Trinity. Now the leadoff man, Maddox McDonald, rips it to left, it gets down. Another base hit for the Tigers and there's runners on first and second. Xander Teeter comes in to pitch for Babson. Swing and a miss, strike three, he gets Preston for the first out of the inning. It's now up to bat, Matias Riding. Grounded. Are they gonna have a play at second? No, they're not, it's into center field. Riding is safe at first, McDonald over the third. And it looks like a run did score on that. One, two to Coney. Strike three called inside edge. Coney can't believe it, he's gonna walk back with the second out. Protecting his pitcher on the mound. Nelson into right. Past the dive of Santos, McDonald will score 
Runners at first and second, and it's a three-run game. Trinity's hit a home run, but it's been a lot of singles and doubles. And there it is, ball four. Bases filled with Tigers. The bottom of the ninth. Hit in the air to deep left field. Back at the wall, see you later. Christian Holloway has given Trinity the lead after being down nine just an inning ago. Really happening? And then it started actually happening for the Tigers. Strike three. One down in the ninth. Basile goes looking. And it's the man who's hit two home runs that's coming up next, Brant Savage. That's who the Tigers will have to go through in order to close out this game. He struck him out and the Tigers win. The comeback is complete as they pour out from the third base dugout. Trinity takes the series, a 10 run bottom of the eighth. They come back and win.